All right, dear people, the more a happy Easter Saturday to you. Uh, as the Lord is in the tomb, we await his resurrection. And as we do that, uh, just know of my prayers for you in this special time. So be sure to offer up what needs to be offered up in this day as we prepare tonight for our largest class ever of incoming people into the church here at St. Thomas More. Uh, it should be an exciting time tonight. Other things to remind you, um, this weekend we're finishing up our donation drive for the University Pantry. So, uh, you know, we've put some flyers out there as far as uh, certain clothing items for adults. So the pantry would be more for adults. Uh, some people have given some child things and things like that, and we'll make sure they get to either. Uh, we have a couple of charities that we work with that accept, um, you know, children's clothing and things like that. Everything from Catholic charities to orphan relief, things like that. So we'll make it get to the right spot. Um, so that's donations, food, stuffs. Uh, there's on the list of the things that they can take in the foodstuffs as well as some clothing. So that's that. This weekend will be the last weekend for that. And the poor box this weekend will go to that. So the poor, poor box will go to the university pantry. We'll um, try and make some purchases to fill in some holes. Let's see what else. Uh, we have a funeral for Jim Nebus this uh, Tuesday at 1030 here uh, at the parish. So adoration will start uh, closer to 1130 um, for our normal day of adoration. So just as a heads up there. Uh, the sisters, Dominican sisters, will be coming in this Wednesday. Uh, so the Dominican sisters will be here the evening before uh, Spirit and Truth to meet with our ladies. And uh, after that, we'll see how it goes. Um, let's see, the Congress, the Eucharistic Congress, is next Saturday. So it's a week from today. It's here at the Convention Center in Columbia. Uh, tickets are sold out. It's over 2,000 people, I think, that, have, that are trying to come. But there'll be a Eucharistic procession. So there's a Mass at 10. There's a keynote at 9 and then a Mass at 10 with the bishop there in the Convention Center. Once it ends, so about 11.15-ish, uh, depending on how long the Mass goes, we'll come out of the Convention Center, take a left on Lincoln, a right on Gervais, a right on Assembly, and a right on Pendleton. That'll be our, our Eucharistic procession through uh, downtown. So that is not unticketed. So if you come down to the parking lot or kind of the front of the convention center and you're there around 11.15, you can definitely jump in the uh, Eucharistic procession. And then afterwards you can stick around. There's some breakouts and things. Uh, a lot of people will be leaving after that, so there should be room. But uh, come to the Eucharistic procession. Uh, I would say if you're at the convention center at 11.15, you'd be able to jump in what is going to be happening. Should be fun, should be interesting, you never know. Uh, and finally, we are in April, so we're in our last month with our campus ministry. So it's always a sprint, March and April. There's a lot of things to be done, a lot of things going on. Uh, prepping our seniors, getting ready for <clears throat> the closeout of the year, prepping for before everybody goes back. So we're prepping all the calendars for next year as well because we'll lose the missionaries over the summer. And then our interns, uh, for the most part, are gone. And, uh, but there's a lot to be done. So we're trying to get all that in order in April budget season, all kinds of stuff. We're trying to finish our hires. So pray for us. Should be good things happening uh, in the next few days. Um, also, just in the kind of percolating in the month out, you know, Midlands Gives is coming up as well. We normally highlight that to fund our Focus Missionary uh, Program, the part that the diocese does not cover. So there'll be more information about that coming out soon. All right, everybody, have a blessed, blessed Easter. Uh, be sure to come out to early to the Mass that you attend if you want a good seat, as it is always packed. All right, we'll see you.